back. Ready? You shake it off. Uh, I think uh, the the Oriole. Bam. <laughs> and adults, children alike, and you are very well respected, not only in the city of brotherly love, but in all of baseball. We appreciate that. All you do. He's got a cold, I think. So why don't you give Mr. Enberg a kiss and no, make I don't up want with a him? kiss. An umpire impersonator who decided he wanted to dance a little bit with the gang. The gang wasn't all too happy about that. So Iggy the iguana, well, he took care of the umpire. That's right. He beaked him. And then, well, then he ate him. <laughs> Big Pop will not pay a bit of attention to orbit. I'm not sure which of those, those two is larger. Couple of real icons there. <laughs> you see the size of it, <laughs> Ben? Ben, would you like some short ribs with yeah, popcorn? I, <laughs> <laughs> I think we're going to need a new table. Uh. Oh. <laughs> there you have it. It is so good. Thank gonna, you for that. Again. It is. Now he's ace of the staff and team prankster. Did he get Jose Ramirez there? No. Oh. Look at it. It's got to be. Look at it. He's having fun. That's he's back beautiful. to normal. He's back to normal. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Tell me they're not going to slide. Tell me the guy. Tell me the guy who's going for all the... Uh, don't do this. Look at all the fine money to be collected by the Rangers. And he has got the Blue Jays right back into this ball game. Monty, look out. Hey, you know that Gatorade bath that we usually get? Here it comes. Get him, Salvi. He says, I don't know if the fanatics speak Spanish. He says, que paso, amigo. <laughs> I think. Right. <laughs> Rays lead the Orioles tonight, 3-1 to one there in the middle of the seventh inning. Ah, he's going to predict the uh, sex of the baby now. As only an alien can do. <laughs> CJ was not ready to go to the bullpen to warm up to come into the game. He always had fun with time of the sword over the years. Yep. I can't believe the fanatics. Been it's always good to see the puppet guy here. <laughs> gentlemen both arms both directions he was flinging Cracker Jack everywhere hey Lou <laughs> yeah you it's on let's go come on bring it <laughs> <laughs> they take the mask off the two down the whole thing they got the numbers on their sleeves they got the uh, the major league emblem so they got the love yeah. Mr. Matt yeah. yeah yeah he's good yeah, he's uh, he's a good guy, and uh, I'm a big fan. Is that oh, you, Laura, no. doing this? It's not that far to Pittsburgh. Our fans don't have a whole lot of fun over there because the Pirates are so tough at home, and their fans are not enjoying this weekend at all so far. Not as much as Jose is. Look at Saki. A little entertainment going on for you there. That's you great get a stuff. kick out of that. <laughs> See, that was all set up. And and duck. We needed it. We, we thought we saw everything in the game, and now a new friend wants to join our party. Hello, friend. Oh, do we go to John Chapang, go to Rango Giz? Yeah, yeah. I don't want to necessarily bother our feathered friend here. Ducks are very aggressive, man, so you can forgive me for that. Yeah. Give up. Just close him again. Meeting on the mound isn't going to exactly. Bring that man to life. <laughs> <laughs> the dark stash you can grow like that. It's so good. I kind of got the blonde. Do is just take care of his glove. This is what happens, Ben, when your glove lets you down. <laughs> and he took care of it all right. Now, you might remember one of the most classic <laughs> bloopers in history with the Mariners here. And a member of the Mariners' grounds crew trying to catch a kitten. And maybe you've seen the high. Here's the big mascot race. Look out. Run over our third baseman. It's Mr. Redlegs sprinting. Six outings when he blew that save 
bullpen was gas, but he came back and pitched a great tenth. Wait, oh. there's even a seagull mascot? Now? I have never seen that mascot. Never. Does that classify as a superhero on Superhero Night? Doing it. In that 1979 championship season. You got to wear the pillbox hat, didn't you? Yes. Yeah. I still have one sitting somewhere. Who's on first? I don't. It was more of a ceremonial thing. It was going to try and go, but expectations were low. But then suddenly some chicanery, and he took off and just ran away from the field. Look at the reaction there from Gonzo, and he coasted home for the big win. He bamboozled the rest of the legend. Complete bamboozle. Never be known. Orbit is one very happy extraterrestrial being right now. <laughs> Pretty astute about the fanny pack. <laughs> Seventh inning stretch time here. You see that? They were going in there. I mean, that, that could do some damage. Yeah, Guys are going for a foul ball. Tough to be in the first row if you have that uh, weapon. Billy, get out of the way. You're going to shish kebab somebody. Man, that's dangerous. At Angel Stadium, to try and guarantee that they get. Oh, it's Fred Bird. <laughs> 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 He's got a fan. So there are two fans out there. But he bought the entire. Poor lady behind him. Well the, well, the poor ladies in front of him. Throws oh, mascot. I think he stole the Fanatic's four wheeler. Yeah, Fanatic doesn't like when you touch his four wheeler. <laughs> <laughs> Slept with her eyes open, Steve. Did you? Oh, yeah, there's a lot of things we don't know about the parrot. The tan. SpongeBob the square pants pajamas. <laughs> Who lives? No grain, though. Yeah. How come there's no grain? Hi. How you doing? Well, it's a pleasure to meet you. Hi. Bob's a big fan of yours. I've been talking about you. Yeah, yeah. yeah. you guys do a great job down there. He's uh, He's been talking about you pretty much the entire game. <laughs> Orbit creating more havoc. That's what he does. Wow. How dare you take Orbit's head? Mm. The lights are going on, but he just can't get it turned over. Jason Worth coming over to kind of help out. <laughs> they just couldn't get it started. So what did they do? They just lifted it up over the railing. <laughs> and that is where it sits now with the lights on. As <laughs> Last night, 14 innings, a long night for everyone involved. But everybody wants to get high spirits. John Axford beating the Diamondbacks, Max Scott, and uh, the Rucks. This <laughs> Diamondbacks take the field behind. Looking good with that red lipstick. There's, they're in seats three, four, five, six, seven, and eight in that row. And here's a one-one. I mean, if that's not the scariest sight you've ever seen, ever, right behind home plate. I don't know what is. That's like the San Diego chicken in. Like that, you've got to have a lot of confidence. That's an error. This isn't going to turn. So Aaron Sebia has looked back and he knows he's being mocked <laughs> by Orbit. Who didn't cry during the notebook? Come on, Orbit. Bobcat was having fun with the Pirates bench and they doused him with some water. Played perfectly. Plus he saved the life of about eight people around him. <laughs> Lucille is given earlier today. Now we're having some fun with um, Astro, the mascot. That's a good mascot, too. Howie topped him and dropped him. Now he's kibitzing with Leonis Martin. As Aaron Sebia steps up, Aaron Sebia walked in the second inning from a a lot of places. I'm glad to see that the uh, the Reds and GABP still entertain the folks with the little organ music. I like that tradition. Mm -hmm. He does a great too, job too. John does. Breaks into some of those vintage rock and roll. Raymond up way beyond his bedtime. 